Today we present St. Mary's Academy Second Line Horns, a.k.a. Smash, led by Mr. Bert Brunos. All right. Thank y'all. Where is Mr. Kurt? <laughs> hey. Right here. How's it going? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. So tell me ab all about Smash. All right. All about Smash. Second line, Horns of St. Mary's Academy. We uh, started a brass band maybe 10 years ago in the program. And... uh. It's all she wrote. We have a jazz ensemble also. Nice. And uh, when we were doing the jazz ensemble, the girls wanted to play some of, some of the second line music. So within the jazz ensemble, we started the brass band. Have you been? Have you started with them at the 10 years ago? Were yeah. You with yeah. The okay. yeah, I've been there since 1980, mm. about right, 89. <laughs> 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 like I can tell in my age. Yeah. So what have you seen? What kind of growth have you seen with this brass band since you first started to uh, this present generation now well um believe it or not the the unit we have now is maybe two girls that i've had since this, since uh the past maybe three years we just got the the brass band program back together okay. this year we, we tried it last year but we didn't have as 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 much success we had had a lot of new new uh talent come in so this is the first year coming back up and you know it's it's, it's making it making a I say making a go at it. Definitely. Yeah, and they they learn to improv and play by ear a lot, and and that's that's what we're trying to develop. So in a couple of years, look out for them. Okay. All right. Well, you know, I must say what what I notice to our listeners that can't see them, this is an all girl brass band. Uh, we right. Yep. What is it like for you to be leading an all female brass band? <laughs> I'm I'm lead musicians. <laughs> I like to hear that. <laughs> I need musicians. That's all it is. I think that's excellent. Yeah. So, what's your inspiration for finding music for for the brass band? Um, what is your vision for the future with this brass band? Well, um, I'd like to take a mainstream. They they want to go mainstream. Uh, okay. As soon as we get our our confidence levels up, this is actually the first performance this year. Oh yeah. Yeah. Congratulations, um, ladies. Outside of the school, should I say? Nice. Yeah, and um. And my vision, I guess, is is well. As far as our music and selections, you know, we try to be open minded and let them select a few. I select a few, and nice. and we work out whatever's uh, within the realm of our talent. That you sounds know. good. Yeah. So you have another song for us, yeah? Yeah, we have another one. What's the, what's the name of the next song? We're gonna send this one out to to a New Orleans thing. Uh, it's called Chopper Style. All right.
All right. Back of House came out for that one. Thank you. I wanted to talk to some of um, the ladies. Caitlin. I heard there's a Caitlin in the building. Hey, Caitlin. Danielle. Hello. Hey, Caitlin. How you doing? Good. How are you? I'm good. So tell me about your experience in Smash. How did you join? Um, in fifth grade, when I was in fifth grade, attending St. Mary's Academy, I heard of the brass band and jazz band. And so thought it would be new besides the marching unit to try it. How long have you been playing trombone? Three years. Oh, wow. Is that your first instrument? Yes. Oh, wow. How do you love it? Well, it's good. I like the, the slide positions and stuff. Nice. And what's your vision for the future? Where do you want to see yourself go with music? Well, we can come back to you if you want. All right. Um, Danielle, so how you doing? How you doing? Uh, so I heard, are you also um, one of the band leaders in this group? Oh, I didn't hear you. I'm sorry. Are you one of the band leaders in this group? Oh, yes, I am. Okay, how did you get started playing an instrument? What brought you to this band? And how did you become a leader? Um, One day, <laughs> the band, they was playing in a gym, and I decided I wanted to be in a band in grade, and I've been in a band since. And um, I don't know. I just wanted to be a leader. The drum section, I'm, I play the drums. Mm -hmm. The drum section is kind of uh like discipline, and I kind of like disciplined stuff, so. Oh, nice. Yeah, You're going to go far with discipline. <laughs> <laughs> Probably military. Right? So what are your responsibilities as band leader? Um, I have to keep the band in order, you know, uh, count off songs, uh, make sure they come to band on time, oh. and uh, a lot of things. It's not really hard, but sometimes it's hard. Yeah. So, ladies, do you like your band leader? Yes. You better say yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and so um, tell me, like, what is so special about playing in this group? Like, f me personally, I've never played with just all women on a consistent basis. So what does it feel like um, to play, play with your own? It feels good. Like, <laughs> it's like a sisterhood. And I really enjoy it. We, uh, we have a bond. Like, we really do. And we have fun all the time, even when we play our music. And we try to... Um, just have fun with each other. That's good. That's the most important thing. Yeah. And the second most important thing. And then the third, have fun. Congratulations, y'all. So I know Miss Leslie Cooper, um, she's waiting in the wings, and she has something special for you. She's coming, she's coming up. <laughs> Thank you so much, Cole, for having us. Um, Thank you. I'll move over to this one so that stay on that one. Okay. He's, we're doing all kind of. So, um, gosh, ladies, I am so proud of y'all today. Uh, the reason that I brought you in during March is because March is Women in Music Month. March is actually Women in Everything Month. It's, it's Women in History and Women in Jazz and International Women's Day was last week. So this Women in Music Month is very special to me, and I hope that y'all will remember that. Um, and when you said sisterhood, I was like, please, please let it, let it feel like that for them. I'm very, very proud, and we're very happy to have you here today. Um, WWOZ, in conjunction with the Gia Maoni Prima Foundation and Entergy, would like to present you with a little gift for your band program. And this is a gift of $1,000. I hope that that will help your band program move forward. Every yep, little every little bit else it does. <laughs> and I also want to give a big thank you to Reginelli's because Reginelli's brought pizza for us that we will dig into after this third song. Uh, thank you again, Cole, for having us on your show today. Always my pleasure. All right, <laughs> another w uh, of our women in music here in this town. And what's your third song? Before I let go. Oh. Before I let go. All right. Thank you so much.
thank you so much, St. Mary's Academy Second Line Horns, a.k.a. Smash, and thank you, Mr. Kurt Brunas. Best of luck. Thank you very much. All right, back to the music, y'all.